Are you curious about how self-driving cars can navigate busy streets with ease? Or how your smartphone can recognize your voice and even your face? The answer lies in the incredible world of neural networks. Today, we're going to unlock the secrets of neural networks and reveal how they power some of the most astonishing advancements in technology. So stick around, because by the end of this video, you'll have a solid understanding of these remarkable creations and why they're at the forefront of artificial intelligence and machine learning. At its core, a neural network is a computer system that's designed to mimic the way the human brain processes information. Just like our brains consist of interconnected neurons, a neural network consists of interconnected artificial neurons, also known as nodes or units. These artificial neurons work together to solve complex problems and make predictions based on data. Now, let's take a closer look at what a single artificial neuron does. Each neuron takes in multiple inputs, processes them, and produces an output. This processing involves two essential steps. The inputs are multiplied by weights, which represent the importance of each input. These weighted inputs are then summed up. The weighted sum, Z, represents the total influence of the inputs on the neuron's activity. Each input's importance is determined by its corresponding weight. These weights are learned and adjusted during the training phase of the neural network. After calculating the weighted sum, Z, the result is passed through an activation function. The activation function introduces non-linearity into the neuron's response. The purpose of the activation function is to determine whether and to what extent the neuron should be activated or fired. There are several common activation functions used in neural networks. The sigmoid function squashes the output between 0 and 1, making it suitable for binary classification problems. ReLU is widely used due to its simplicity and effectiveness. It replaces negative values with 0 and passes positive values unchanged. The tanh function squashes the output between minus 1 and 1, providing a balanced response. The choice of activation function depends on the specific problem you're trying to solve and the characteristics of your data. Activation functions introduce non-linearity into the network, enabling it to learn complex patterns and make more accurate predictions. Neural networks are organized into layers of neurons, typically categorized into three types. The input layer. This layer receives the initial data or features as inputs. Each neuron represents a feature or attribute of the data. The hidden layers. These intermediate layers process the data and extract relevant features. They are called hidden because their outputs are not directly observable. The output layer. The final layer produces the network's output, which can be predictions, classifications, or any other relevant information based on the problem you're trying to solve. Before we dive deeper into the fascinating world of neural networks, if you're finding this video informative and want to stay updated with our latest content on programming and technology, please consider subscribing to our channel. The true power of neural networks lies in their ability to learn from data. During training, neural networks adjust their weights and biases to minimize the difference between their predictions and the actual target values. This process is called training, and it often involves optimization algorithms like gradient descent. In summary, neural networks are the fundamental building blocks of artificial intelligence and machine learning. They simulate the way our brains process information through interconnected artificial neurons, enabling them to learn from data and make predictions. As you delve deeper into the world of AI and machine learning, understanding neural networks will become increasingly important. I hope this video has given you a clear introduction to neural networks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.